yo guys brad back on the channel today with another video yeah we'll just get it in there straight away we are relegated we are down not pre um not playing premier league football next season uh, if you haven't already check out the two videos i made not long ago when explaining why like five reasons why the premier league's better five reasons why, uh, five reasons why the efl championship's better but today we're welcoming the foxes leicester city to the john smith stadium this is a a match that would have, uh, it was a 1-1 draw last year here. Uh, we should have taken all three points really, yeah, an offside of, an, well, an offside decision that was clearly wrong, ruled out a Kachunga goal, so it cost us points last time. Not that points or anything, not, not that anything that we get today is gonna matter in the long run. It's just something to give back to the fans if we do get um, some out of this game. At the end of the day, see if it's preparing for the championship now, there's no, there's no point like hiding away from the fact that we're not good at, they weren't, we weren't good enough for this league. We didn't, we didn't buy well in the summer. We didn't do a lot of things. Referees' decisions haven't helped us. But then again, not, have they helped Cardiff and teams at the bottom end like that? Because that against Chelsea the other week was absolutely appalling. The, the refs, um, it's like Warnock said, the refs need to take a long look at themselves and think, what the hell was that? Um, but yeah, I am. I'm gonna be honest. I'm looking forward to the championship season here next year because um, there are. It does have its perks, but um, hopefully we can bounce back. Maybe get promoted within one or two years again. If not, championships are decent league to be in. Um, if we're an established championship side, I can't argue with that. So, anyways, enough of that. This this game. So, see if it's gone with him or in goal, which I'm pretty sure no one's gonna be happy with. Smith right back. Kongolo Schindler, Eric Derm with Chris Lover left mid, Mike Cam, Pritchard right mid, and Grant up top. Grant, he's in the lead, I believe, for the goal of the month against West Ham at the London Stadium. It was a great goal. Didn't go because I have my reasons. I, uh, I don't think I'll, I'm not going to attend any more away games this year because I believe it's not worth spending like, £100 for me and my mum to go to an away game. And then, you know, it's not gonna mean no, in terms of just it's just going. And um, I am a loyal supporter, but I'm not I'm not going to anymore. I'll save my money for next year. Then I can go to more away games next year, go to more places next year. I can see a team that where all eleven players are actually gonna be trying. Because that against Bournemouth the other a couple of weeks ago was absolutely atrocious. Some of those players needed to take a long hard look at themselves because it was nowhere near good enough. So yeah, I'm just gonna go into the stadium now. I'll be back when we're kicking off. So just to quickly add, I am indeed, uh, I've got some good news, so obviously the seat I'm currently in is in Rebel Ward, as you can see, that, this is my, this is where I'm sat, uh, in the stadium, but next year I'm good, FIFA songs, okay, play God by Sam Fender, right, um, but I'm going to be sitting, well, standing in the cow shed next year, um, singing, chanting, every game, if, um, if they're getting started. Uh, reason being, I like where I'm sat, it's a good place to sit. I like the people around me, I get along with everyone, I talk to them a lot, but I just, um, the, the atmosphere is unreal in that section and I just want to be a part of it. And um, it's just a great place to be. To, um, I'm, I've not got a preference within standing or sitting really, but you know, to be over there will be great. And. I know people in there, so happy days, fair enough. But if you haven't already, like this video, or watch it all, then like it. Please no dislikes, I don't, unless I say something like, call like, Sch Schmeichel like, something. Please don't um, dislike, there's no need for it. So, leave a like on the video, subscribe to my channel, follow my Instagram, uh, Brad Barbs, add my Snapchat, add all my social media, if you wanna get in touch with me at all. And also, if you, if you see me, and you recognize me from YouTube, come and say hi, I'm not gonna bite your head off. And um, yeah, I'll talk to you about the game and stuff. But yeah, up the town. Come on, let's try and do something today. Right, so it's currently half time here 
and uh, just finding somewhere to, uh, nice and quiet. But it's half time. Uh, the quality definitely shows. And the difference in quality is definitely showing in this game. It has done all year, to be fair, and uh, this is the reason why we're going down. I'm not even going to lie, but um, Leicester do deserve to be one in front. They could have scored a couple more, to be fair. But I've said it off camera a couple of times. I can't wait until next season. We're, we're going to be able to win it more than three games, and if we don't, then then I'll, I'm really wrong. But you know, it's not so bad that we're going down. We can bounce back from this. But I'm really looking forward to to, um, to next season and championship to see what we can do. But what I didn't um, what I didn't make clear at the beginning of the video, I am not attending any more away games. But this is my second to last game in the Premier League because I go on holiday to Gran Canaria in the Easter holiday, so I miss out Watford, and I'm um, most likely going to give the ticket to my mate and his mum so they can go watch. But. Um, but yeah, my last game um, watching in the Premier League for well, for a while um, in town will be against Manchester United. So the biggest club in the country by far, but the biggest club arguably in the world. And um, see what Solskjaer can do over here. Last season we beat them. We're not going to beat them this year. You've literally more chance of this video hitting 1 mil views. And if it does, I'll, I'll run down my stream, my boxes, so it's not going to happen. Um, but yeah, I can't wait for us to go down. We've, um, we've been alright today, but no, no better, no worse than every other week. So yeah, Leicester deserve it, definitely. But I can't wait until next season. Can't wait until this match is over. Watch, watch us against United and then watch the Championship, finally. Because this season has been so bad. What's Take happened is, just after the goal, Mendes took a massive touch, and then, I, I don't know if it was for the handball in the box or the trip on Grant, but Mendes took a massive touch, then their player slipped. Yeah, the guy that looks like Lord Farquaad. Did I call him Farquaad? I don't know, I'm calling him Farquaad. But, um, and he's handballed it, or it looks like it, and then he's, and then he's tackled him. And tripped him so there's two ways it could have been put but Moise is going to take it against Michael whether he scores it or not will we, I don't know if we'll care or not because we've won one and that's all that matters He's gone out key for him, he's brought him down, he wants to sit back there. It gets, it gets worse. He scored here last year, can he do it again? Oh! Just got in. Ryan and Neil have saved it. Ryan and Neil have saved it, but he didn't get enough on it. Like the video, subscribe to the channel. Thank you guys for watching. I'm out. Up the time.